Local artist Chris Rogers is spraying his final touches on the biggest stage in his life. Not much makes me happier than my art being able to be received by a lot of people. We met Chris outside the Q2 stadium where he's been painting since 1 a.m. Words can galvanize people or they can drive them apart, but images are very powerful and hence the reason I wanted to portray a lot of brown faces on this mural. It's called Whispers of the Heart and features musicians like Gary Clark Jr. and Stevie Ray Vaughan. So you have the past, the present, and the young girl in the middle, the future. With those three things combined, like anything's possible in my opinion. Sending a message of unity is nothing new to Chris. Last June, he painted the George Floyd mural in East Austin. People would come up to me, especially on the east side where there was a lot of black people, and they would thank me, sometimes with tears in their eyes, uh, for not only doing the art, but painting faces that looked like theirs. His art caught the eye of Austin FC and approached him last year to bring his vision to the stadium. We sat down with him and kind of talked about the ambition for Austin FC what we want the club to stand for, what our mission is. He took it, he ran with it, and he created this beautiful mural that we're going to have on our stadium for a little while, which is fantastic to see. The Austin FC Artist Initiative will bring in new local artists every few months to have their work displayed to the over 20,000 fans that will be attending the games. And if you're one of the fans at tomorrow's home opener, you can stop by and see the mural next to the Zebra Gate. And there's an African proverb that says, if you want to go fast, go alone, but if you want to go far, go together. And so that's my message here. Painting a stadium bigger than soccer, one stroke at a time. In downtown Austin for KXAN, I'm Claire O'Connor.